Hold up. Hey everyone, welcome to the second episode of Literally Succulents. And um, basically today is going to be like more of an update on what's happened. So here I have my panda plant. I haven't repotted it yet. Maybe that'll be next episode, but I'm not sure. It really depends on when I can get it, when I'm free, because I'm kind of busy right now doing sports and all that stuff and school. So you can see in there, um, it, it's grown like two new leaves and they're at the bottom. You can, see, you can also see that it's lost a lot of soil, that's because it tipped over. I went to the beach recently, so, and it was really windy that day, so I wasn't able to keep an eye on it. But luckily I caught it and some of the contents spilled out, but that's fine. The plant is still good. I also am currently watering it. Um, I don't have a watering pot. Maybe I should get that while I'm buying the pot. But I do have a water gun as like an improvis improvised. So I just do that. Oh. Sorry about that, my dog interrupted. Anyways, back to what I was saying. I just have a water gun as like something I use to water. It's my first time watering it. So yeah, I just put up like not that much. Like until I see water coming out. I'm already done watering it, so I'm not gonna add too much water. So I'll just put that back. And yeah. You can see I'm filming in a different area this time. I'm in my garden because last time I noticed that the audio quality outdoors was better than indoors in my room. So I'm trying to give out better quality videos. Now we're gonna go on to the propagation. It's been about five days, so that's more than enough time to dry it. So I transferred it in here with a few other leaves of my big brother. And then there are my three leaves. Uh, I think this is rotting, and I think that's rotting. I don't exactly know what's happening, but I'm pretty sure that these are no use because they're rotting. So, But I'm just going to keep them there. Actually, no, I'm taking them out. Goodbye. But this little leaf is looking really well. And as you can see there, it's, well, it's gonna do well. This, of course, it takes a lot of time, like months, maybe to five months, but it's all worth it for a new little baby plant. Anyways, back to my succulent. Since I'm outside, I'm gonna show you my elder brother's two plants. And he's really the one who got me into succulents. So here is his like his second plant. This is his first one. His first plant is doing really well. As the, you saw in the propagation right before this, he took off some of the leaves. One of them is mine because I made him take one off for me. And anyways, it's doing really well. It's really healthy. Um, one time it did fall over and it lost a lot of soil because of that. So it's not really filled up like this one. But as long as it's living, right? And then under there, you can see there's two things growing. And, oh, oh, you see, oh, look. You see there, there's a new plant growing. Maybe he can remove that and maybe he can start a new plant. So if you hear a lot of birds, I'm outside again. <laughs> Anyways, this, he got the same time as I got my little baby. And it's doing really well. It looks so cool. It's like, whoa. And, oh no, something's happening. Yeah, that's rotting. This little one is rotting. He's gonna have to take that off soon. I'm not gonna touch anything, just in case, because he doesn't like me touching his stuff. So I'm just gonna put that back and focus the spotlight back to my baby. Over the past few days, I've been really busy, so I haven't been able to take it in, so, Considering, considering it's best for it to stay outside, I kept it outside for a long time in one area so it got as much sunlight as it needed. 
so that's a little update for you. But I am still going to try to keep that indoor-outdoor focus. But overall, it's still doing great, and that brings us to the end of episode 2. Thanks so much for watching if you made it to the end. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you want to see more. Bye!